All right, if you have any items stored in your locker and you want to export them and save them, what you need to do is go up to My Locker up at the top of your screen. When you click on My Locker, um, you'll see what you have in your locker. I have a file folder that has three um, images in there. So if I wanted to save them, I need to connect to Google Drive. So I'm going to click on Connect to Google Drive, and I need to make sure I choose my account and log in, give it permission. Now that you've connected your Google Drive, you will see it on the left-hand side underneath My Lockers. To move what you have currently in your locker into your Google Drive, you want to be on your locker. So mine says Heroes Locker. I only have one folder here that has some items in size, inside, but down below I might have other things. Let's pretend I had 10 different documents here. I could check each and every one of them, or to make it easier, if you just check right here, this white box in the gray box, that's going to select everything that you have in your locker. Then to move it, you're going to click move up here at the right, sorry, up at the top, and it says move to. Now I can just click on Google Drive and it will move it everything randomly into Google Drive. But I could, if I wanted, have a folder set up that I can put it into. Um, so I might create a folder in my Google Drive first and just say like everything from School Loop, just so everything gets moved into one spot. And then um, once I've selected that particular folder, or in this case, I'm just going to select Google Drive, I'm going to then press the blue button, Submit, at the bottom of the pop-up. Now you'll see that my locker is empty. That is because that folder that I had just moved over into my Google Drive. When I go to my Google Drive, I will be able to access all the files that were in my locker. They will no longer be stored in School Loop.